Hey, what's up? I am back with another Holland video, but this one is a morning Holland video. I um, had an early morning wedding gig to do makeup and glam some um, ladies up, and me and my sis AJ, what up? Um, went and hit the 24-hour Walgreens um, because she had to grab something and I figured hey might as well pick up a couple items because I saw that they had some stuff that I wanted to get so um, uh, let me show you guys what I got um, it's kind of some of the stuff that I got in the lunchtime hauling video but I actually uh, went and got some more of the wet and wild bronzers because you can never have enough bronzer I use a bronzer every day so these go pretty quick um, I also wanted to get some as backups because I had stopped at a couple Walgreens and they are pretty much selling out like hotcakes I did get another one in bikini contest I'm oh, sorry if it has this plastic stuff on it that's how new they were I got bikini contest and then I got um, another ticket to Brazil right here and I actually have that one on not too too dark right now but um, I don't know if it's like lighting in here but it's an awesome awesome bronzer it's matte it has a slight 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 bit of shimmer in it so that's awesome if you guys like stuff with not too much shimmer which is something I like I would definitely compare them to the NYC um, bronzer that they have which I absolutely love and I have in my kit as well for clients then I have got those two already in the last um, luncheon haul but I found the third in the collection and this was the one that I knew that they had but they were all sold out at the one that I went to so I ended up picking this up and I wouldn't so much say that this would be a bronzer as much as it would be a highlight so um, I, you could probably use it as a bronzer if you're really really fair but I would say this would be more like a highlight it's called reserve your cabana so again super super ginormous it's pretty much the palm of me hand so yeah Tons of product. Again, like I said, has the expiration date on the back. So added two more bronzers and the third one. So my collection is complete. If you guys are trying to find these, you guys better get out there quick because all the ones in Orange County, Anaheim area, Garden Grove, uh, Fullerton, Westminster, gone. And if I saw them there, I picked them up. So um, then... You guys saw my video yesterday, how much I am effing loving the new Wet n Wild polishes. I still have my fingernails polished. My mom was like, oh, I like you polished your nails all different colors. I'm like, no, I was just swatching for videos. So, again, I ended up picking up four more colors. There is one more in the collection, but it's a red. I'm not probably going to get that one because now that I've been buying lots of nail polishes, I have like a couple reds in there so I'm not gonna go buy another red it just looked like a basic red so who knows maybe you'll see it in another video coming up but I went and picked up these final ones right here I'll go ahead and show you guys all of them and then at the end of the video go ahead and stay tuned because I'm gonna do like I did in the last one and show you guys some actual swatches on my nails and just show you guys how much one coat of these does and the um opaqueness of them and also just how they apply so you guys can see them and then you guys know exactly what the colors look like um let me go ahead and show you guys the first one actually my mom really liked this one and she probably will be painting her nails with it it is called wet cement sorry i want to make sure you guys can see the color and it's like a really pretty like asphalty grayish purplish color um there's the name wet cement and again love the bottle size they're really like um sleek and slim and you get a lot of product and again these do have the um manic curve pro brush as it says on the lid and that just means that it's the thicker wider brush um as far as the bristles go similar to the sally hansen insta dries so I also picked up this awesome like fuchsia magenta-ish kind of color purpley. I don't know, kind of looks more magenta on camera, but this one is called Through the Grapevine. And one thing, if you guys are looking for these at the Walgreens or whatever store that you guys are looking for in your area, you have to remember that these are not going to be where all of the regular wet and wild stuff is, okay? It's going to actually be on one of the display cases at the ends of the aisles. It's going to be somewhere like at the end of the area where the makeup is. Like, you'll kind of see them around. So kind of, you have to look around for them. So don't just think, oh my God, they're not here. They just have the same old stuff. No, you have to look at the ends of the aisles because they have special little, like, display centers for these. So again, this one is in Through the Grapevine. 
Next, I got Undercover. And this is another really pretty, like, pinkish mauve color. And finally, I picked up Sugar Coat. And this is just a really pretty pale pink. You guys saw the Candylicious one in my last video. It was more of like a Pepto Bismol, as I kept calling it. This is just a really, like, faint, faint, faint pink. So, um, that's what I picked up. I just wanted to come and show you guys, because like I said, I promised lots and lots of videos. And at the end of this month, just so you guys know, I haven't ever made a favorites video, but I will be doing a January favorites video and also I got a notification that my tulip maven box package is pretty much going to be delivered today if I don't get it with the mailman I'll get it by Monday because I'll have to go pick it up at the post office but there will be a video coming out on that as well so all of you nail polish addicts out there that are watching um, do stay tuned I'll have details and also some promotional codes and things like that so I'll leave the um, names of the stuff that I got, polishes and the bronzers, down below, as well as some information like my Twitter, my Facebook, um, my website for my makeup, and all that other stuff. So hope you guys all liked my stuff, and stay tuned for the um, swatches of the nail polishes, all right? Peace! Now on to the swatching. Woohoo! I'm going to show you two colors at a time. The color to the right is one that I'm really, really loving. It's a mauve, and it's called Undercover. And then over to the left is the Sugar Coat color. And as you can see, this is really, really, like, see-through on my nail. It's a very baby, baby pink. If I added another coat, I'm sure it would be a little bit darker, but I am using only one coat on all of these. Let's move to the next polishes. Over to the right, we have an awesome color that I'm going to be painting my nails with tonight. It's Wet Cement. And then over to the left, we have Through the Grapevine, which is an awesome, like, purple, pinkish, barney type of color. So, um... I am in love with these polishes. Go get these ASAP. You need these in your collection if you're a nail polish freak. And again, this is Undercover um, Sugar Coat Wet Cement and Through the Grapevine. So head to your Walgreens.